Hey guys, today we're going to do a video on how to get a GBA emulator, which is called Eclipse. This is Killer IDKG. Make sure to not forget to subscribe, like this video, and share it with your friends. Okay, I'm gonna show you all the steps in a simple process. So basically, this works for iOS. 14.2 and all the information is down in the subscription so there's going to be two links one's for the eclipse to uh, bookmark it and the second one below it is to download it okay now let's start first you like so this is what it's supposed to look like the setup this is the website up above it. So you're going to skip skip setup and scroll down to the very bottom. There should be agrees and continue. Now click that. And then you scroll down again. And you can click that, but it tells you to add this as a bookmark. So down. Wait, wait, wait. So you're going to click this little square, this little square with the arrow pointing up, it um, bring you up to add to home screen, so add to home screen, and click add to home screen right there. And you'll have it on your phone. You want to click Eclipse, so click this, and it'll tell you the same steps. So Eclipse currently supports all these NES, SNES, GB, GBC, GBA, SMS, SGG, basically all different kinds of games. So you could download it from the next link I'm going to show you. So click skip setup and go to agrees and condition continue and close setup so basically this stuff so before i tell you anything else there's stuff in the setup there's like skins basically if you want any skins but these don't work trust me and um fill screen you could add that and then go back so all that is ready for you know downloading games so scroll down go back to safari which is located okay next go to this website which is located in the description and then you could scroll down and download what games you want now this is um supported with uh ness so you could play those types of games if you like and how you do that is either download one of these games I show you and then you click download right here but basically it'll start downloading right here as you see you click download that download button right here and it'll show up in this little pointed down arrow circle thingy and basically it'll show that it's downloading so you want to click this part click this game and it'll show you the zip so the zip is right next to it so it says Pokemon fire red you click it and it'll drop a um, click the zip and it'll drop a new file basically the GBA as you see below and then you want to go back to the um, go back to the Thing that showed the library the app basically or you could go back to the app and click or go to upload upload go down to where it says the one without the zip it says fire red gba right here and then you're playing it now so you could have audio but i'm not gonna have audio because i don't want to get copied right here. Oh lord, oh no, it's young audio, okay, that's enough of that. <laughs> okay, so basically, 
This controls the volume. This controls fast forward. Controls stored save game, which it doesn't work, trust me. I'll show you. But fast forward makes the game go faster. You can see that the volume turns it loud, quit, you cancel the game, which I'll show you at the end. So basically it started and I'm, oh my god, okay, you get the point. Now uh, you can click quit and it'll lead you back to the library. And basically you can play all different kinds of games. Not just GBA, but also NES and some other games, which is shown in the information when you click the first link. And you could download the games by the same steps. Which you want to go back. Hmm, that's strange. Okay. Now, you want to go to click roams. If you want to download the other games. Now, it tells you all the different kind of games. So, GBC means Game Boy Color. Now, you could download this game. You could play Pokemon Yellow or Crystal. And click download again. Or if you want to download other games. Like the, um. Ness, which is what was Ness again? Hot oh, turtle stuff. Okay, um, there's SSG, which is probably Sega SG 1000. You could download games from there, and you just look around here. Some won't work, but some will because it's it it's able to process all that. Okay. So basically, that's all for this video. I'm going to go back to NIST. And we have it right here. Empty library. And you could download games. Make sure to like this video. Hit subscribe. And turn on your notifications. And share this with your friends. Leave comments below. If you're um, still stuck on anything. Because remember, this only works for 14.2. I'm not sure if it works for 14.3 iOS. But if you want to check your um, software, you just go to general. And then you go down, which I'll show you. Yes, I'm not going to show you, but you get what I mean. Go to settings, go to general, and then go on about. On your phone and you will find the information if your phone is able to run this emulator and that's all for this video I'll see you in the next one